What's up, guys? Welcome back to the Sci-Fi Bookery. I'm Josh, and this is Short Story Sunday, starring Christmas Bestiary again all through December. I'm reading short stories out of this book. It's a collection of short stories that follow different mythological creatures, and this particular one is called The Abominable Snowman by Laura Resnick. Laura Resnick is primarily a fantasy writer. She writes a ton of fantasy, has written a ton of fantasy in the past. This story right here is um, pretty fantastical, so it falls right into that, um, right into her alley. The Abominable Snowman is, as you could guess, a story about the Abominable Snowman, who lives in the North Pole and is friends with Santa and Rudolph and the elves. So the Abominable Snowman has a problem, though. He really hates the cold. So he moved there from Tibet after being run out by the natives um, when they found him. And he's a big, scary monster. He's over nine feet tall, white hair or, or fur, I guess you would say, big teeth, big claws. So the natives were scared. They ran him out. So he found him his way to the North Pole and is invited to go to dinner with Santa and Mrs. Claus. Uh, and all the elves and Rudolph and everything on Christmas night to celebrate you know, another successful Christmas. So there's also a little bit of the story where he talks about um, the different explorers that have come to the North Pole and gotten lost and all that. And it's a lot of really funny little anecdotes throughout the story. Um, I thought the comedy in it was really good. It's cute, quaint, and... Um, quirky, I guess would be the words I would, I would throw in there. So the story is this explorer who, oh, I got to find his name. Uh, where is it? This, this book is only a couple pages long, or this story is only a couple pages long. Oh, it's funny. There's like a reference to Jimmy Hoffa in there and stuff and, and all that. Oh, where's the name? Um, anyways. Oh yeah. Hillary, uh, Sir Hillary something or another. It's a really long, funny name. But anyway, so he gets lost in the North Pole. He stumbles upon the cave of the abominable snowman and hilarity ensues. So I really enjoyed it. It's a fun little like kind of buddy comedy in a fantasy world of the North Pole with Santa and all that stuff. So it's really fun read. Another good one out of Christmas Bestiary. This is Short Story Sunday on the Sci-Fi Bookery. We'll see you next week.